Hi guys, welcome to Fan Cam's Luke. Oh, fuck, Jesus Christ, what a win! Uh, it keeps us alive. Yeah. Live to fight another day. Last, um, that's all we we asked in it really. Just take it to the last game, and final day anything can happen. As we saw at Huddersfield a few years ago, um, we deserve to win. I don't think Forest were at the best. I think um, they've got well both eyes on playoffs with that performance. As you, do you think you just did a uh, interview with, with Forest lad, didn't you? That yeah. said that that's the, their worst performance, and they didn't turn up. Dawson really kept them in game. Their defender, experienced lad, but I felt we. We started strong and then we seemed to fade and I'm like, oh, is it going to be another Millwall, another Wigan where we start quick and don't take us chances, Brown, come on. If he takes his chances, he's the 30 year lad him. Oh, come on. I mean, first half, I think it's confidence. I don't know if it's confidence. We, I don't know what it is, but he gets so many chances. Yeah. He gets so much at ball and he just... Wish Woodrow, the fall yeah. to Woodrow, um, didn't you? I mean, I felt Woodrow made a bit of a difference when he came on. He got stuck in up front. Played him up top. He's got to start Wednesday for me. You get your best players on pitch. Final game now. Do you know what I mean? Get your best. Get your best eleven. We just. I've just spoke to Steve and he just said that Brown were better at wing back. Well, yeah. I think Odewar should start on uh, Wednesday again. I keep saying it. I think he's naturally left footed. We need to go for three points. Um, might suit us because Brentford obviously a good team. Um, my work for a really good game. I felt. Thomas had a good game. Yeah, unlucky to come off for me. I don't think he should have come off. I think Ritzmeier should have come off a lot earlier. I don't think Ritzmeier should have started, no. but we'll not we'll not discuss that. You no, know, I'm not going to look back at it. But I don't. I, I, I questioned why he made so many changes after the performance against Leeds. Just think of old games since lockdown. Like we've not looked in any danger really. Maybe it's Stoke one, but other than yeah. that. We weren't hammered that day. Look, I know people are saying you, you, <laughs> we would have been safe by now if we, if we. But again, we were his own worst enemy that day. We gifted him three goals, but we could be safe. We could have looked at Luton and got another two. Could have beat Wigan at home. Could have beat Millwall, but we never make it easy, do we? Yeah. That's Barnsley FC. We don't support Barnsley FC for easy times. We know, we know it's never going to be easy. We never make it easy for a cent. Um, but that goal obviously gives us another. Chance to fight another day. Luton and Luton and Charlton have been looking that result at nil nil, thinking fucking yes. But pressure's back on them now. We go down to Brentford. We're obviously massive underdogs for it because they've got to go for automatic as well. But, but I, I, I'm we so, I, for it now. We, if we can play like that against we have against Leeds and Forest, similar application. Yeah. We're just going to be more. Tech, we, we'll create well, chances. Clinical. That's that's the it's issue. Collision rate. Defensively, I think we're all right. I mean, possession. We were like sixty odd percent in first half. We'd so much at ball, going to some great areas. Set piece has got to be better. Got to, we get so many corners and free kicks that we're just wasteful with. Um, I mean, maybe change it around a bit. Maybe start Almer on Wednesday, get not not up top, but for set pieces. Yeah. But we've got to be better deliveries. Young lad played really well when he came on Wolf. Yeah. Um, I'd like to see him get involved. And like I said to you, this is, it's nice to see for the future, the likes of Styles and Simoes after uh, lockdown. Mm. Been real bright sparks. Palmer did okay. So there is uh, bright lights from this lockdown, even though... You know, we could still be going down next Wednesday. We've, 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 there are positives for me. We've only lost one game. I know. So, yeah. And the seven points, we had seven. We had a tough mountain to climb from start, didn't we? If we didn't win that first game against QPR, it could have been, you know, psychologically we could have been done. But we've kept in it and it shows that the lads... They dug in till end today. And we needed a bit of luck. How big that put a point at Leeds would have been. I know, I know. You know what I, mean? I know, and we deserved the point. And maybe it's about time luck went our way. Um, that chance did go in Schmidt with goal. He don't score many, but goals he gets are important. I mean that Millwall one. Millwall one, yeah. Um, good, good little finish. To be fair, in right place. Lineker goal and Ryan with Gary Lineker goal that. Fox in box. Fox touching that, but maybe we need to go a bit direct against Brentford because they're a good footballing team. Maybe get stuck into them. Well, that might work for us because yeah. they might. Will they be able to let us play? Let us play, but also when it's needed, getting them second, yeah. getting them second balls, make it scrappy from them. There are a lot of foreign lads in that team that like to play flair, yeah. like to play football. Let's get stuck into them. Like at Stoke, if you watched the game at Stoke other day yesterday, Stoke bullied them. So maybe we need to go down there and you know not leave one on them, but just let them know we're here. Exactly, and we need to. 110%. That's all we can ask for. If we lose, if Brentford passes off Park and deserve three points, we go down. It's not that result that's the reason why we've gone down. There's been points we've dropped to other places and at home this season and other things that we could have been prevented. That yeah. you know, But we've, the lads, fair play to them. Struber, fair play we to them. We played well today. We did, we did play well. As a we team, we played well. Deserve yeah. three points, mate. Thoroughly. Should have been three or four. <laughs> Should have been a lot more comfortable, but it is what it is. Result now. Nah, don't matter about what scoreline is. Three points. Nice to see that that passion from Struber oh, at end running up pitch. Voldemort. 
Nagini at side of him, S sliding up pitch, bold and boldy. I loved it, mate. Dylan Grant. He needs to wear the same clothes for Wednesday. Yeah. Everyone, if whatever clothes you've wore yeah, today. Does that mean you need to them. you need to make your chili con carne then, I don't you? Mate. And everyone needs to wear your same clothes on Wednesday. I'll eat my veg soup, what yeah. I had before you, you came. To do little rituals, oh, just no, little no, just little bar. things. You have your iron bar, James. And you know, visualise it. I visualised us winning today. So do it all all here, Wednesday. Either just little or, things. Either that or chip shop yeah, effect. Yes, bro, but listen. You get to that stage. I didn't think we'd stay up at Huddersfield over a year and we did. But lads fighting spirit. If we can if we manage to stay up, that'd be one of the biggest if we manage to stay up Wednesday, we won the biggest results in recent clubs' history because that's the difference between keeping six million to spend on proper players. And all from looking dead and buried as well. Yeah, because this could galv you know, could galvanise us, you know, I was thinking that under Flickcroft a couple of years ago, it could hopefully galvanise us and Struber. You know, hopefully he can stay and hopefully Woodrow thinks differently if he's been looking elsewhere and thinking, well, I've got another year at Championship, mm. you know, and sell sell it to the likes then. But look, I'm looking ahead. <laughs> it could all be ruined on Wednesday, but look, we deserve to win. Take huge positives from it. Dressing room will be fucking... I'd love to see it be flying up wall in the NR. Nah. We're, we're half done anyway. We, we're good around here. We everything to... Yeah. Pressure's on Brentford. Mm. They've they've got to win. They'll be expected to win. They, they, they beat us comfortably earlier in the season. Let's go down there and show them that we were, we were a better team than that earlier in the season. Different manager, yeah. Different circumstances. But we get, just get everything. Everything. That's all we're asking for. You know, final day. You know, it's funny. It's funny football. Some things, sometimes, you know, you're not expected weird to... weird kick-off time, like what James says, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I think it should be on next Saturday for me. Well, yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't get... I don't it's Wednesday. Yeah, it should be, it should be a week. By Give teams way, a chance to prepare way, for it. Thing, I'm just going to comment on the EFL situation. It's a fucking joke what's going on. I mean, Sheffield Wednesday, you know, they're not my biggest fans because, you know, I'm a Barnsley fan, but what's happening to them and um, Wigan not knowing what's going on? It's a fucking joke. I mean, we might go down and yet... They might have points deducted and we could stay up due to that. It's a joke. It should you can't prepare yourself mentally, can you? Deduct it, do it there and then. Yeah. Don't wait till the season's done and then do it. It's a joke. And obviously, if they've done things wrong, blah, 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 then obviously you shouldn't. I think it's because if they take them off and, and it and we can obviously still stop up, it doesn't make any difference to them. So they'll take them off at next season. Do and then Because what does that say to other teams that can get away with it then? I mean, you know. Um, but it's EFL's done a shocking. It be, it's been a disgrace. They're keeping people in, the, you know, they're keeping people in, uh, in 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 dark. I mean, teams down bottom deserve to know what's going on. Yeah, yeah. Um, but thoroughly deserve. Take positives from it. Bring. I'd bring a door in on left hand side on Wednesday. Um, I'd start Woodrow. Maybe start Alma for a bit of pr physical presence in that team. Ritz Mayer can't start for me. I'm afraid. Probably will though. Won't it? it probably will because well, I don't. I, <laughs> I'm not going to say what he's probably done to deserve it, but um, he's, he's, he's just going to get exposed there. You've got to have a bit of physicality and thump it middle. Moe, we're playing for two players at times. Yeah, there were times he didn't do too bad, but it's like five-yard passes. And he's, even his, I said to you, even like likes to Chris Dagno when he were here. Weren't a great player, but his work rate made up for it. That's why I let Brown off most of the time, due to his work rate, and he puts effort in. Yeah. Ritz Meyer's just like jogging about as if he's in Cannon Hall Park going for a jog. So he needs to do a bit more for the team, in my opinion. I mean, you need your best players in Wednesday. Best players, your match winners, get Woodrow in team, start him up front, and let's, you know, let's go for it. Let's, let's go for it. Let's go for it. All right then, guys. Well, thanks for watching, fan cams. There'll be others on to follow Luke's. Thanks for your support, you Reds.